Dit is eerst nou tijd voor paarstijd in ons gaan keier bij die wijnproducent Jordan. Yeah, you know, this year has been a real whirlwind of awards for Jordan. Uh, I mean, over the years we've been rated one of South Africa's top wineries, but this year was just the cherry on the top. And I think uh, with George Jardin being rated uh, in the top three restaurants in South Africa, based here on the property at Jordan Restaurant, kind of set the standard for us to kind of push the envelope a little bit further. And uh, this year, not only were we the top wine estate in South Africa at the Veritas Awards, which is our national wine show, but also uh, for South Africa, and I suppose for us in particular, uh, we were the world's, we made the world's top Chardonnay. And at the uh, Decanto Worldwide Awards, uh, I was really surprised. I was called up and this was the top prize, the best Chardonnay, I think, out of 14,800 wines that they tasted. And of course, we, we went on a few weeks later to win uh, the top uh, Chardonnay trophy at the International Wine and Spirit Competition which I think for winemakers would know that would normally go to a, a French producer, but uh, in this case, South Africa was tops. Jordan is a really interesting property in that it's the only farm in this whole region with north, south, east, and west facing slopes. Sounds interesting, but why would that be important? Well, the north facing slopes are the warmest, and so that's why we grow Cabernet in that area. The south facing slopes, going right up to 410 meters, above sea level where we can see five wine regions. You can see both the, uh, the Atlantic Ocean off at uh, Table Bay and the Indian Ocean side towards uh, False Bay. Much, much cooler and so that's where we grow Sauvignon Blanc. East facing, uh, we've got our best Chardonnays getting that morning sun, looking out over the most incredible Stellenbosch Mountains. And then west facing, which is a newer property we bought, and I say newer, 20 years ago, a newer property um, where we uh, have planted uh, all red varieties. You get the last rays of the setting sun going down over Table Mountain and Robben Island, and uh, that's kind of what hits this vineyard. So all planted to Shiraz, and then Cabernet and Merlot, which we do as our Cobblers Hill uh, blend. I see good with Max So I always feel like the feeling is the first time to prove, and you know it's good. And the scene is not bottle and you have it so you can not even get it. The first thing I do is to make my quality to hand off. You have to do it every year, the same quality to hand off. Um, after 18 years, I worked myself in a position of work where I tried to see what we were going to do. We were not on Jordan's brand. Um, yeah, and we had better wine to make. All the medium-rise top quality to get, maybe not top quality, on a higher level.